Welcome back to a beautiful Friday morning here at Casa Texpina. We're on build day number 201. Um, most of the regular labor crew is here. Uh, we've got a couple of extras, so we're switching in people uh, from other job sites. Um, so we're going to walk you around and show you where everybody's at this morning. So let's get started. Start off back here in the uh, master's closet this morning. We got Mr. Alex still continuing to work the um, cabinetry, doing some th more finishing work on it. I think he's doing the shelves over here on this side today. That's what he's working on. And Mr. Rafi is doing mud and tape for the uh, fiber cement board ceiling that we've got here. And again, remember we did the uh, fiber cement board ceiling here in the uh, master's bath and master closet because we're going to be here more often so they assume we're going to have more humidity in this area than we do in the other side of the room other side of the house so we decided to go with the uh, fiber cement uh, being that it's more uh, water resistant and resistant to the uh, humidity let's go see where everybody else is at this morning take a walk out here Miss Emmy's already doing her inspections this morning. We got paint going on the ceilings. We got paint going on the walls. We got more tiling going on in the kitchen. And we are continuing to uh, put in the kisame or the ceiling here on the uh, back patio as well. Uh, this is Mrs. Fer Mr. Ferdy. He's back with us again today. Okay, let's go ahead and take a look back here. Mr. Jill, our lead painter, is uh, doing the painting on all the moldings, the window moldings. And then as you can see through the window, we got Mr. Allen starting to do the uh, finishing for our cabinets. Uh, so that's going to be the uh, molding that's going to go around the bottom edge here. So kind of like cornice, but on the bottom edge. And the uh, foreman is over there doing the tile. Mr. Gabby helping him out as well as with Mr. Jojo. Uh, God bless you. <laughs> and here in the uh, garage, we got the carpentry shop going on with all the varnishers and the finishers. Um, this is again Mr. Andy, Mr. Henry, and new guy on site, Mr. Francis. So, this is uh, Henry's brother, and uh, he's helping out with the carpenters today. Let's go ahead and walk on in through the, back through the house. Okay, coming on back in through the house. We got some guys down here on the guest side of the house. Our electrician, Mr. Chokoy, is busy digging out um, conduit locations, roughing in the conduit for our vanities. And Mr. Jojo is wrapping up the uh, tile, the wall tile here inside the powder room since we have our uh, vanity wired in now. All right, our uh, granite installer showed up just prior to lunch. They're uh, still busy cutting the, the granite, cutting the quartz for the kitchen area. All right, let's go see how it looks on the inside. Smell it. All right, so they still working on the corners, the pieces. So they're slowly working piece by piece. All right, let's go see what's going on down the hall. Ah, putting the, the frame in for the top of the um, linen closet. Doing a little bit more uh, mycelia for the um, coat closet area. Looks like we're doing floor tile now for the 
uh, powder room since the wall tile has been completed. So the next thing up here is going to be, so the next thing in this room is going to be finish up the floor tile. Once the floor tile is dry, they'll come back and start working the uh, paint for the ceiling. So that'll be tomorrow possibly. Let's go take a peek through here. Looks like my uh, our electrician, Mr. Chokoi. Anaibato again. <laughs> okay, no, no, no holes in the PPR. No holes in the PPR today. <laughs> Only one? Okay. So this is to uh, give us the hole he needs through here for the vanity light. So he's pulling down the, the conduit from up in the ceiling on the back side. They'll pull the colt through here and then they'll connect it through the wiring that goes up for the switch. The switch goes up in the ceiling and they'll connect it up there on top. So that's how they'll work that. All right, let's see where everybody else is at. We're still working. Yep, yeah, looks like we're still working uh, some of the uh, stairs here. You notice right here underneath the kick, underneath the kick plate, they're starting to work that a little bit. And let's go ahead and go back to the other side of the house. Oh, more paint. <laughs> Mr. JR is painting the, uh, painting the roof, painting the roof, painting the ceiling. And bedroom number three. All right. This is still base coat. Coming into the master. Still working on uh, shelving and skim coat. We're working on skim coat on this side. Shelving over here with Mr. Alex. Oh, look at that. Our dirty kitchen's almost got all the flooring in. Last couple pieces here. All right. And out here in the hallway, or out in the garage, I mean, um, our guys are still working on the doors. Slowly, but surely. Let's see, we've got a couple out here on the front that have been burnished. And now we're getting a little bit more stain color. We'll see there. Well, the engineer's brother-in-law came bringing more gifts again today. Uh, we've got two new sets of tiles. Um, so what they're going to use is the big gray squares that we talked about yesterday. They're going to use that for here on this first step. When they come into the next section, they're going to switch over to this tile. So it's got a little bit of a, a grip on it, but the, uh, the color should help match, should match a little better with the lighter color. That's what we're looking at there. And these tiles, don't mind the squares, that's just from the, the underneath where they're all stacked. Um, these tiles here are gonna be the new tiles for the um, floor tile in the master's uh, bathroom. It is kind of plain, um, but that's okay. It's a, it's a plain uh, gray. It is a matte finish, so it is not going to be uh, with a little bit of a, a grip on it. it. It does have a small texture to it, uh, so it should be good for in the bathroom. Um, also, if you noticed, it is a little bit thicker than your normal tiles. So that's what we're looking at for the master bath now. Looking in here in the uh, master bath. 
Mr. Allen is already starting to work on the pull-out drawers for the uh, master's closet. So he's got the larger pieces, cutting them down to smaller sections. And they're gonna start, he's gonna cut those into here for our pull-out drawers. All right. And backside of Mr. Rafi over there is doing uh, skim coating, second coat of skim coating on the inside of all the cabinets. All right, back here in the uh, powder room, we appear to have run out of tiles. So they're still looking for some more. See if we still have them on site here somewhere, but we may have run out of four tiles uh, for this section. So they're continuing to work the ones that they do have. And uh, we'll start looking around, see if we have some more. If not, the, uh, it'll be a nice shopping trip if somebody needs to go on. So in speaking with Mr. Andy, the uh, varnish guy, we have completed, or he has completed, he and Mr. Andy, oh, Mr. Henry, have completed half of the doors. So we have 26 doors total. And he says we are down to 13. So they still have 13 doors remaining. Okay, time for another one of my uh, not so accurate predictions. They've been moving tiles off of the back porch for a little bit. I'm thinking they're probably going to get ready to start um, tiling this back porch area here. Uh, probably next week. I'm not assuming tomorrow. Tomorrow's Saturday. I don't think they'll do it to start tomorrow. They'll probably do that on uh, next week. Um, also, the um, section here through the back hallway and into the, the pantry is one of the last sections that they need to do with the large floor tile. Um, and the uh, foreman is complaining and says it's too much traffic here. So what they're going to end up having to do is get here early in the morning, block off the door on this side, block off the wall on this side, and just get to business uh, before and make people walk around. So we'll probably look at that tomorrow, uh, first thing in the morning, hopefully. Well, you know how my predictions go. All right, so they're putting in the uh, quartz countertop here in the kitchen. Remember the other day I was talking when we were in the dirty kitchen about the size of the backsplash. Well, the normal size of backsplash in the U.S. is only about a four inch backsplash. Uh, that's the same material as the countertop. And then the rest of this would be mosaic tiles or something like that uh, for your normal backsplash. Well, here, uh, the, the general consensus of the way things are done, the way I'm told, is that they typically go with a 30 centimeter backsplash of the same material 30 centimeter being almost a foot um, what you're seeing here is uh, the compromise this is a 20 centimeter uh, backsplash so this is what we're going to go with around the all of the kitchen areas so we're going to have a 20 centimeter backsplash and then the rest of this up here uh, we'll get the mosaic tile effect um, at a later point all right guys we're going to call it a day um, most of the guys already put their tools away. They're just doing a little cleanup before they uh, leave out for the afternoon. Um, a lot of tile done today. Uh, you saw we finished uh, both kitchens. Uh, so tomorrow we're going to move on into the hallway in the pantry. And that should be the last of the main floor. Um, that, that main floor tile with the exception of the maid's room uh, out in the garage area. So they'll get to that at a later point. Um, yeah, so tomorrow we may be looking at, we'll finish that up, and then Monday we'll start out on the tile on the back porch. So y'all make sure to tune back in next week for that. Make sure to tune back in tomorrow for the finish up of the kitchen. If y'all like today's video, please give us a big thumbs up. If you'd like to see more of these videos, hit the Casa Texpina star right over here, and you'll be subscribed. For the, hit the bell icon just below the video screen, and you'll be notified of our next video upload for your viewing pleasure. So until we see you again tomorrow, have a great afternoon and God bless.